My path to medicine started pretty early. I had a desire to do something in the sciences very young just because I liked science. Um, and as I went uh, through high school and college, I spent some time volunteering at a hospital uh, in Dallas, Texas, where I grew up. And I had these fantastic experiences taking care of kids and patients, and I enjoyed um, supporting the patient and the family in multiple different ways, whether it was sitting there while they were crying, feeding the babies, um, or supporting them when they were happy. I really enjoyed it. I've always had an interest in the arts. I'm a photography, photographer and a painter. Uh, and in medical school, I honed in on surgery really because of the combination of art and science, getting through uh, patients' different anatomy and uh, tweaking the procedure to make sure it's uh, tailored to the patient is really an art form. I started out interested in cardiothoracic surgery and vascular surgery, wanting to treat heart disease and vascular disease. And the part that ultimately changed my mind to morbid uh, treating bariat or bariatric patients and obesity was I could, if I treated patients with obesity through bariatric surgery, I could actually prevent the heart disease or improve their heart disease. And I love the ability to take patients off their medications and give them a second chance at life because of the fact we've been able to improve their blood pressure, improve their heart disease, improve their lung disease, get them off their diabetic medication, save them some money, and give them the energy they need to spend time with their families. One patient particularly who had a ventricular assist device, meaning a machine in their heart, pumping for them because their heart was too weak to do it itself, we were able to not only get the patient to have that uh, machine removed because their heart was doing so well, he also came off the transplant list. And I find that that is reflective of how beneficial bariatric surgery can be for the right patient. The first question I ask a patient when they come in to see me is why do they want to have weight loss surgery? Why are they interested in this? And everybody has a different answer. Uh, and that can help me understand why they're going through this process, whether it's just they want to be able to walk around without pain, or they want to be able to chase their grandkids around the playground or the house. And then the question is, what surgery do you want? And we take that surgery and we try to make sure it's the safest thing for them through the uh, preoperative process where we have them see a bunch of experts that are part of our team and do some imaging and lab work to help us make sure that that's the safest choice for them. And most of the times the patients know what's best for them and it's just making sure that we're doing the right thing and we've confirmed that they're right. I'm originally from Chicago. I have family in the Midwest and I've always loved the Midwest and the people here. They're just very sociable and kind and easy to talk to and easy to take care of. Washington University specifically has always been an interest of mine all the way back from undergraduate school to now. It's uh, within the surgical world, it's one of the best programs in the country for training residents and future surgeons. So I have this unique opportunity at Barnes Jewish Hospital with Washington University to teach the next a generation of surgeons, not only about general surgery and minimally invasive surgery, but what I love, bariatric surgery.